nazywam się Martyna Płomecka. Mi chiamo Susanna Gołbi. Hi, my name is Rachel. Nazywam się Piotr Radziński. Cześć, mam na imię Beata. Mi chiamo Samuel Lazzari. Ona ma żonę na zjedu Krystyn. Ja jestem Alisa Dedic. Ciao. Moje imię jest Paolo Czasy. Moje imię jest Leila Hrustic. My name is Zeneb Ashraf. Salam, soy Vanessa Riesam as Iran. Hola, mi nombre es Luis Rodríguez Pino. Ich heiße Verena Walla. Verena Hafsari. Bene, madame Beza Aik. Anes Nidana. Hi, my name is Ali Javed. And we care about your mental well-being in this time of crisis. We formed a team of neuroscientists, neuropsychologists, and data scientists affiliated with some of the best institutes in the world. An ongoing effort that started in the end of March, which is completely voluntary and involves intricate coordination, has already screened more than 13,000 individuals worldwide for general psychological disturbance, depression, and post-traumatic stress resulting from the COVID-19 pandemic. This effort involved working with validated, comprehensive psychological skills and some of the most rigorous data analysis and visualization to identify that between one third to one half of the individuals assessed showed some level of psychological disturbance. Certain factors make you more vulnerable to be psychologically affected during the COVID-19 crisis. Being a female, Having a pre-existing psychiatric condition, prior exposure to trauma, especially before the age of 17, and working alone from home increased the odds of psychopathology during the COVID-19 crisis. However, there are also some factors which can protect you. Being able to share concern with your loved ones like usual. Positive outlook about the resolution of COVID-19. Daily exercise for at least 15 minutes or ideally one hour. We are hopeful that our study will help in dynamic optimization of mental health support and services during this time of crisis. Stay safe, stay motivated, and let's be there for each other.